How's it going, everybody? It is your boy Ringo Flats, and I have a little bit of bad news. Uh, so, I remember how I said I got a new uh, racing sim wheel for uh, whatever other video games I want to play. Well, to order, like, to calibrate it, you have to get the Logitech app. On, like, the Logitech G app. Well, it uh, updated my microphone without me wanting it to. And so, like, it completely messed up the way my microphone goes to. I don't know what it is with my Zelda games that I, I dearly love and terrible audio. Like, you remember in Ocarina of Time, there's a stupid thing where the audio got desynced and it was really upsetting. I got really mad. That's why one day I'm going to play Ocarina of Time again because it pissed me off so bad. Well, it's kind of similar. My voice just, uh, it, it, I mean, it's, it's not nearly as bad as that. Like, there's no, like, real audio problem. But it just changed the way my mic sounds and stuff. I don't remember the settings I had my mic to before. I'm trying to get it as good as I can. But, like, the way, like, the noise gates works and stuff. Like, I used to like, even though it was a little loud, I used to like the gain that my mic had coming through it. Like, even though you can hear, like, everything in the background, my voice, like, I don't know why, but right now, when I go back and listen to recordings, my voice sounds more like this than it usually does. And, uh, I'm not sick or anything, so my voice should, really shouldn't be changing. It should be a little bit deeper, like it is in, you know, real life. Going back and listening to the other recordings, it, it, it sounds fine. But, uh, yeah, I, uh, something happened, and, uh, <laughs> the recording got stopped for the last episode of filming. And I was like 10 minutes in, so that kind of sucks. And so, uh, we mi you missed a little bit of the gameplay. So we went to that island here supposed to go to where I said the water temple was going to be at. Uh, there's no water temple. Uh, the island was destroyed. Quill, the bird man, came and told us, Hey, uh, if you're looking for Jaboon, the water spirit, he's actually on your home island of Outset Island. But uh, you can't go there. Or you're not going to be able to find him there because uh, yeah, he's in a cave and you can't reach the cave without something to move the big stone that's in front of it. And I accidentally told the pirates that he was there too. And so you're going to need to uh, go and uh, stop those pirates too. So uh, they're on Windfall Island. So now I'm heading to Windfall Island. I'm a little bit upset. You know, it was a cool little scene. I'm sad that y'all got to miss it that I don't want I don't want that for anyone I forgot to feed the damn fish so I'll have to go back there at some point it's that, it's that island behind me right there but, uh, it's okay it's okay I I went and messed with my mic a little bit sounds still not as good as uh, I prefer I'll have to do some fiddling with it later but I really want to record today I don't want to have to record later on about halfway through the distance. Yeah, not good, not good. The last episode did it, like I said, my voice didn't sound terrible in them, but not as good as I'd like. And the noise gate wasn't high enough, so like my voice clips a little bit like talk quiet, so I'm talk loud, you know, like most people. But uh, now that part should be figured out a little bit. Um, actually, my voice could be turned down a little bit, actually, so I, I keep my mic on. I'd prefer to have some of these earlier episodes have some weird audio issues in later episodes because now I'm going to go back and start listening to them to make sure they're not doing I know there won't be any desync at all. I hope there won't be any desync. I think that was with the way the videos were rendered because it's been fine since then. I fixed the pro. I don't remember how I fixed it on Ocarina of Time. Like the, the finale or the last two episodes. or the episode right after the water For instance, there's like 10 episodes of kind of messed up audio where they start lagging. That, that's what I'm not worried about. That. I just worry about my voice sounding good or not. Like I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess with it. Maybe uh, turn up the bass a little bit. That important plot. I know not what they are researching, but if they are hoping to get their hands on Jaboon's sacred gem, I doubt they would tell you anything directly if you were to ask them. Ringo, I think you should try to find out what the pirates are up to without them finding out. I know 
think I... Uh, I think I can go to the auction house first and get the swift sale. I can definitely do that right now, or while I'm here. Need more mail. Oh, yeah, I got, I got a letter, too. No, no, you saw me get the letter. Letters for Ringo. We have one letter. Here's your letter. Uh, I can't remember what the voice I gave to uh, Orca. Uh, or is it something like that? Or is it something like that? I wish to be a true swordsman. Find some knight's crests and turn them on. Exactly where the auction house is, but it's somewhere over here. You definitely want to go to the auction house. This might be it, or it might be the level below. I'm not sure. It's the level below. Okay. Oh, we never talked to him. I don't know if that's going to change if we can get it or not. I know you can only access it at night. Have to do it after you uh, talk to him. Obviously, I don't have the uh, song of the, or the sun song, whatever it's called. But I don't. I don't think. It's... First thing I need to do, actually, though, is bring up a guide. Dear me, but there's a terrible storm raging this evening. The night seems very unsettled somehow. Okay, I might need to do uh, some stuff on the island before I can get it. I'm pretty sure I can get it right now, but I might, I might be wrong, though. It's gonna take a few tries to get it, though. I'm like, not like losing money a few tries, because I know, I, I can't remember. I'm gonna have to look up a guide to do it. Might be the only part I look up a guide for playing this game, but. Close things. Square up now. We never actually visited him while we were here last time. Yeah, he sells bombs for way too much. I like, think he's like 30,000 rupees. Oh my god, Link. Because you can't even carry uh, 30,000 rupees. Or he, yeah, he wants like 20 or 30,000 for like uh, 30 bombs. Not how we're gonna get all this. Yep. Can, you do, can, can you not just like walk back around with him? Does he have to jump? Just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly you've been running here, yeah. <laughs> so I bet you're thinking it was foolhardy to ask pirates to pay such an outrageous price, huh? Yup, I bet you are. No, no, it is. Okay. You know, Gonzo, I still can't get over that bit of fast talking you pulled to get that information off the most. set my eyes on that ring. I just knew he was hiding something back at outset, yeah. So when I saw that postman, oh, uh, I, I don't know. He's talking. So when I saw that postman, I just pretended like I was all worried about the kid and stuff. Presto, he spills the beans. Good 
work, Gonzo. Really, just top notch. It's funny though. I'm thinking this is maybe the first time you've shown such a wit. Cunning. You know, with your cunning and Miss Tedger's smarts, you two got married and had a kid. The kid would be the greatest pirate to ever sail the seas. Yep, the greatest. Oh, you idiot. Yeah. Keep your mouth shut, yeah? Don't be so stupid. I'm like 35. <laughs> Stetcher, are you listening to this nitwit? Did you dock him some pay or something? Quit goofing off, both of you. Keep your childish jokes to yourself. Get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading them up, we're setting off for sail for Outset Island. What, miss? We have to leave immediately? But it's been so long since we were on shore. We need to fill our bellies with some good eating, yeah. How about, we eat How about we grub tonight and shove off tomorrow morning instead? I mean, um, I'm fine either way, of course. Whatever you say, it's fine, miss. I, uh, what I meant to say, uh, it's just that the boys were so excited to come to town, you know, I can't help but think it'd be awful hard on them to leave so soon without a proper layover. So, what say we set sail tomorrow, yeah? What do you say, miss? Uh, the treasure ain't going anywhere. Done with me, rap boys. It was for a night of fun. You're all fools, do you know that? You saw that demolished island. You saw the senseless destruction. We have to hurry to outset. The same thing could happen there. Huh? Not to be disrespectful, but by the sound of things, you're worried more about the island than the treasure, miss. Don't be ridiculous. I want, you know, treasure. She knows. Alright, fine. Have it your way. We can leave town tomorrow, you big babies. But we're setting sail at first light, so no sleeping in, understood? Please! Aye, aye. Say that, brother. What's today's password again? Mako, are you serious? You forgot already. You're so useless. Today's password is... Schooner. Yeah, remember? C-H-O-O-N-E-R. Schooner. You know that Nico won't let you in if you don't say it exactly right. Password, I can't, I'm not gonna be able to remember that. I need scooter. Password is scooter, yeah. Scooter, ah. Yep. We have to wait for Elvis Costello there to yep. come back and learn that song. I can sail upon the water. Oh, what is the voice I gave him? I think I can. My voice like that. I can sail upon the water and be filled with it. I am a. Guarding Miss Tetra's room. She's got a cool lamp. I don't know what that is. Is that a triforce up there? I think it is. It is another triforce. And, uh, uh, yeah, good reaction. Like, was he actually making that face looking at it? 
He is. <laughs> That's cool. I never notice he does that. Do you have any other weird things? No. The chest. Ah, oh, Ringo. My old swabby Ringo. So, you're alive. All the other pirates said you'd done in that. By that or you were... You, uh, da, da, ba, da, ba, 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 da, ba. All the other pirates said you got done in by that big old bird from the Forsaken Fortress. It's all done. Never mind what I thought. You're alive. Oh, I get it now. You came back because you missed me so much. I had no idea you wanted to be my swabby so badly. I see. I see. Well, after you left, I went back to being the bottom rung on the ladder. Which is why I'm stuck here while everyone else is in town having fun needing stuff. I guess being so worshipped by my swabby ought to cheer me up. Alright, why don't we set you to your next test, huh? This one's harder than the last. Good luck, you'll need it, swabby. You see there are lanterns hanging throughout the room, right? Well, last time when you pressed the switch, platforms rose up for you to jump onto, right? Well, this time there aren't any. Which means you have to jump from one rope to the next rope. Pretty tough. And that's not all. This time, I've put a gate on this door, too. The switch opens the gate, but it'll close if you don't get here before time runs out. Run out of time, and you'll have to try it again, little swabby. This one's the more difficult of the two. This one, it's still fun. It's still not too hard. But I, I, I remember there's been a few times I've messed up a bunch on it, and then there's been a few times I've done it, like, first try. If you get all the way to this side before time runs out, I'll give you the bombs we got in town. Yeah, you heard me. Give it your best shot, Swabby. Yep. <laughs> well, off to a great start. Uh, I need to situate myself to look at the screen better. I'd rather just go ahead and reset. Make sure we have all the time we need. No, Link. Why? You're hanging right at the damn rope. Grab it. Oh my god, Jesus! Screw it. Oh my god, Link! Already? Oh. You are not incredible. This isn't good. I've never passed this test. How could he do it so quickly? Make it look so easy. If I give this to him, everyone will know for sure. I'll be so busted. Okay. You're the best swabby of all time, so I guess I'll just give you the bombs. Go on, take them. Just don't tell anyone, okay? I'm serious. Really serious, okay? Okay. Mighty courageous of you, trying to steal treasure from pirates. I suppose I should be shocked, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of that tower. From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet, huh? You don't give things much thought, do you? 
you just rush in, never thinking how badly things could go for you. Like just now, the only reason you got what you did was because we left a simple-minded rat like Nico behind to look after things. No one else would have parted with our treasure so easily, I assure you. And just how do you intend to use those bombs, anyway? Don't tell me you're going after Jaboon's treasure, too. Right now, Jaboon is hiding in the cave at the back of the island you are born on. But the entrance is blocked by a giant stone doorway. You can't get in without breaking down the door. We're gonna relax in town and eat our fill of whatever this town has to offer. We'll be leaving for outset first thing in the morning. If you manage to find Jaboon tonight, then I guess you win. But if you take too long, we'll come sailing right by you tomorrow morning. And believe me, you didn't get all of our bombs. You'd better be quick, kid. She's so punctual. Wow, awesome. You have a stone just like the one that Sandra has. I'm sorry, you're gonna get your ass kicked, buddy. <laughs> Nico was drawn and quartered by the rest of the crew. They sent each of his limbs to the four different islands. Just like Willie and Wallace. You know what? I'm, I'm pretty confident that if these pirates attack me, I can kill them all very easily. None of them are very tough, and I do mean none of them. I'm pretty sure I, yeah, I'm pretty sure I can't get the swift sail yet. But, just in case I can, because I got that, I'm going to go check the island, or go check the auction house. If it's open, it's open. If it's not, we'll wait until after we do this. Now I'll need to come back here during the day. And then I'll need to uh, talk to Elvis there. Yeah, okay. We can't get the swift sail yet. Not a big deal. I think there's also a piece of art we can get here. I'm not sure. There's some cool stuff to get in here. There's also like magic armor or something like that I can get. I've never gotten it before. But it, I'm pretty sure he uses like rupees or magic. And, like you can't get hurt, but he, I'm pretty sure he uses rupees. Good evening! Letters for Ringo, we have one letter. Here's your letter. 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 Notice from Beetle Shop Ship. It's time for our semi-annual Big Chance Extravaganza. We have a new product that bursts on the scene. Bombs! Thank you. Done. Preparations are complete. What the girl says is true. The pirates won't be leaving until morning. Let's meet with Jabu and get the pearl from him before they arrive. Let's delay no longer. Okay, it's time to go home.
so many pee hands. I know, I don't even think you get it that way. I'm pretty sure you get bombed by you have to uh, help that old lady on the first night. She gets her bomb stolen. You have to help her and then you can go buy one from uh I'd play the rehydrated or the original. So I'm, I'm, the rehydrated is really fun. It's the same game. And it looks really good. Man, there's something really nostalgic about the original. It'll be a hard choice. There's also Curse of the Flying Dutchman, which a lot of people don't like, but for some reason, I, I absolutely adore that game. I think it's very fun. It can be janky sometimes, so I guess some of the platforming is a little difficult. But I also haven't done tried to do the platforming in a while, so. Have you noticed, Ringo? Morning is not broken since you arrived at Crayfish Island. Well, y'all don't know about that, because you could, didn't get to see it. The land that was so ravaged by monsters. As if time itself is frozen. Perhaps this is the curse that Valu spoke of. Whatever the reason, if this night does not end, then we need not worry about the pirates overtaking us. 
In fact, it might not be a bad idea for you to visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. We can speak with Jaboon after you do. Okay, so yeah, they want me to speak to Grandmother. I need to talk to him real quick and see how many uh, heart pieces I need. Or not heart pieces, how many knight's crests I need. Oh, he's pushing sharks again. Uh, ah, Ringo. You're all right. Why did you not tell me about Errol? That was thoughtless of you. This island has seen hard times ever since you departed. I do not know what you have been doing in journey, but you seem a little more daring these days. That look in your eyes, not the one you left here with. Very good. Show me just how much you've improved your sword skill. <laughs> if I must say so, your skills with the sword are still at the level of a page. Very good. Try to hit me a hundred times or more before I hit you three times. being so stupid it's not that hard now I gotta do it you have hearts God, do you have mushrooms growing in your house well I can't blame you now we're get we're doing this before we move on I don't care if this I I need to extend this episode a little bit longer Doing it. <laughs> I'm being so stupid. I'm parrying. I'm hitting A. Enough. There we go. 
Ah, 103 blows. You have improved. I guess it was wrong of me to treat you like you are still a lowly page. A page no more. You are a knight. Knight. Which is not much, but it is now yours. Take this with you. Something I can't use. I need, I need to ask him about the Knight's Crest. What's that? The Knight's Crest? Does that intrigue you, young one? It's still too early to discuss such things with you. But if you happen to cross ten of those, show them to me. I can tell you what they are and what they do. But I only speak if you get ten of them. How many do I have? I have two. So I need to get eight more. I know where I'll get eight more. Honestly, they're not that hard to come across. You just, there's just a certain, there's only one enemy that drops them. We actually haven't even fought the enemy yet that drops them, but I just need to remember. Like, there's a part where I'm pretty sure there's eight of them or something like that. I think there might be exactly eight in this certain part. There's still some before that, too. But, uh, I always forget. All you need to do is grapple them, and you get one each time. Sometimes you can, you, or you'll always get one from grappling them, but then you'll also get one from, uh, killing them, too, so... I don't know. I, I should be fine. So that'll be the next after the next dungeon I do. Or shortly thereafter. It's so probably like two or three episodes. Oh, no, there she is. Oh, are you okay, Grimble? Uh, Ringo, Errol, don't go. Don't leave. Uh, don't leave your poor old grandma. All alone. Uh. Ooh, she's looking. This looks bad. <laughs> I know what I need to do. I already have a fairy, so... Let's go ahead and do it now. I, I am going to go visit the great fairy. Oh, Ringo, it's that you. Grandma is always happy to see your bright, shining face. Ringo, my dear sweet Ringo, you're safe. That's wonderful, just wonderful. Did you do this? Did you heal me? Oh, you're such a sweet child. Oh, that's right. You and your sister, Errol, are trying so hard to be strong. I've just been sitting here moaning and worrying. I'm your grandmother. I'm the one who should be taking care of you. I'm so sorry, Ringo. I haven't even considered what you must be going through. A terrible grandma. There you go. It's all I have to give you right now, but you can keep it in your empty bottle. You got elixir soup. This healthy soup your grandmother makes replenishes all of your life, energy, and magic power. Okay, also doubles. So it's like lawn lawn milk, but even better. Yeah, it's too healthy soup. You and your sister love the soup, don't you? If you run out, I can make it for you anytime you like. Grandma's going to be try to be strong. You try to be strong too. But don't do anything reckless, alright? Like going into dungeons and such. Oh, okay. I thought you gave me an extra jar. I don't like you anymore, Grandma. <laughs> I need all the jars I can get. Okay. I'll let this episode run a little bit longer. It's like uh, it's 39. Or no, maybe I'll start next episode. Too. I'm gonna go visit, uh, Great Fairy. There's some extra stuff I can get here on Outset Island now that I have the, uh, Boomerang. I really, or not the Boomerang, now that I have the, uh, Deku Leaf. But I really don't think I, uh, should because I'm pretty sure it's Rupee. One of them might be a, uh, Oh, please, I hate those things, man. It's not even that they're hard to fight, they just, they just don't stop. I don't even know if we're going to do that. It's fun, but it's uh, hard to do. I'm looking at it over there, that stone face. Oh, 
I need to get a Give me some magic bottles. There we go. That's what, that's what daddy needs. Now we fly. Yeah, that's new. We're gonna be needing to go to that soon. Young Lake of Winds. Allow me to aid you in your quest. Smooch. Oh. Carry more rupees and they can hold a thousand. Now I don't have to worry. The fairies in this fountain shall ease your weariness when you go fatigued from their battles. Come here to be with you. Thousand and one. Sorry, not five thousand. Five hundred. Hi, anyway, thank you all for watching. If you like this episode, be sure and hit that like button. And if you really liked it, be sure and hit that subscribe button. You can find my Instagram down in the description below. And with that, have a good day. <laughs>